Hello, welcome to 2025 with the first video that I'm making at the phone. 25, what can we talk about? I was wondering, why don't we have a teeth replacement? Why does it happen only when we are babies, like a little kid? Why a science doesn't come up with the technology or discovery analysis from the charts for all these reptiles or animals that can replace a limb replacement, some reptiles, they just suck their legs off and I think they can come out again with the tails and then come back. But as a human, uh, I think uh, when we are babies, starting the age of six or seven, we start changing our teeth to a natural. Why? Can you imagine having an injection when you're that age to delay that process and seeking a start when you late 20s? And you can still have a functional, really good and a steady, with a nice developed baby teeth, but they still look good, beautiful and nice that you can be proud of, not like a tiny. And I'm not assuming that you wanna be old and your bone already stretched out and still have a baby teeth. Why not? having that reverse nature to have a good teeth while you are a baby all the way to the age of 20 and then maybe you start changing to permanent teeth after then maybe we will not be able to actually have to wear prosthetics in the end of our, our life there is a lot of young people also wearing denture now i'm just saying that there is a the denture is for literally for only old people Kind of a weird thought. I'm sure the science is trying to find a way of, of a human to live longer and humans to maybe get limbs replacements instead of a prosthetics. I watched some National Geographic thing that some scientists were after that. One of the things that I'm saying is that a lot of people get frustrated with what their dentures are. Look, people, this is not a real tea. This is just you the teeth to start learning to live with i know they will be uncomfortable i know you're not gonna find the right one and unhappy with the situation but sometimes there is not other way to do it you don't have no gums it's the bottom line you don't have no gums for the denture to stay on your mouth and your gums just gone and you have to learn to live that way because this is the way your new life is, gumless, and with a denture trying to fall out of your mouth. If you have an upper denture, and with the missing gum like that, how is it staying in your mouth? Will not be staying too long because unless you have it glued in, it will just come down. It's a law of nature. The gravity in your mouth, and you don't have it anywhere to retain it, it will come down. Another thing, some people, I would say lower dentures is the nightmare. I would say from maybe 2 out of 10 people are unhappy with their lower dentures. Why? It's the nature of the lower. They, they go like this, flip to the side, flip to here, does that, goes up and down. It's just a nightmare. If you still have one tooth on your arch, just assume you still have one tooth here, another two here. Don't take them out and stay and keep them because that could be the difference between living a better life with your lower or living a nightmare. If it was me, I'm talking about in my own personal opinion, I'm not suggesting anything. Let's see, this is me, right? And I still have one tooth here and it's still good. Another here, I will live with those teeth because if I take that out and, take, and then my dentures might be loose. I would just leave my teeth alone. Least, uh, hey, dude, I only have one tooth. Leave it alone. I am not going to remove it. That's what I would tell. I'm not going to remove it because that tooth can make the difference to have a little clasp around it and uh, have adventures that I might stay in my mouth because that tooth, that's what I would say. No, that's what I'm trying to say in this video. Again, by the way, just don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification. This is my new video. Let's talk about something. People are mad about TikTok going dark. Well, see, just let it be. I don't care much about the application, actually. I do have an account there, but 
I don't care. I watch more YouTube when I get home. That's the first thing I tune into is my YouTube and check on the people I follow, watch the new videos. I don't watch the cable TV. I watch YouTube. It's better to have a YouTube for me than having a cable TV. That's what I watch. I don't go and watch TikTok because normally they just play the same thing on your For You page, actually. So, when I would say be happy with your denture and learn and appreciate the dentist that working with you. You don't have no teeth. There is no solution to that. Be happy with what you got. I believe it's communication is very important. The dentist will not have a miracle to solve your problem. There are some outrageous dentures out there, but there is a wax triumph that you can actually have the opportunity to make the difference and change the outcome of your denture. If you're not saying much on your wax triumph, then that's a problem that you might have in a future because you are accepting something that does not work out. Considering you don't have a much options because it is a denture. But then obviously if you start looking like that, too much of a gum and you have a nice and small face and you see an abnormality, you will detect that in the first single wax triangle that you do. That you're showing too much teeth, this is not you. You feel disconnected with that denture. You have to speak up. If you think this is too loose, uh, no. If your denture is too loose because your anatomy, your gum, there is nothing there to retain the denture. You're gonna have to use a glue for the rest of your life because your anatomy is not helping out. Don't be blaming anybody for what's going on with your body because your anatomy is no longer there. There is no denture. Maybe the implant, if you have a bone for it, they're going to cost you more money. Sometimes it's because the technical way of getting impressions done, the impression was not taken correctly, but those are the minimum things that can happen. The impressions, I, it could be because some impressions, but if you should second time or if you already had a denture previously and you have the same problem with the retention it is because it's you and stop collecting one two three four five dentures looking for the right one like a pair of shoes or purses it is you anatomy right so i would say if i would buy me and try to get my smile restored i would look for the best I will try to take the best of it, get some nice and beautiful teeth to smile on. When I get home, I will just take them out. Why would I have, to have some piece of plastic in my mouth all the time? I will take them out. Maybe I will be gumming my food while I'm home. Why not? Or maybe I use my denture, that's my choice. So I will say, this is the new beginning of the year. If you are looking for denture, you still have some teeth. Try to find a solution for those teeth before you get to this world of a wedding, prosthetics. If you have some resources or money invested on you, teeth, before you pull them all out, then you will be suffering all these problems of now finding the right one for you to see all this collection of adventures I have here, different shades, B1, uh, BW7, BW3, BW7, BL3, that's what I thought to say. Anyway, it's my time is up, it's 10 minutes of this video, don't forget to subscribe, hit a notification, I see you in the next video.